Hey, it's Cody. It's Sheldon. And it's What's in the Shop. And we've got this matte defender here. Um, Sheldon, what can you tell us about this one? Yeah, this thing is sick. It came in for the trifecta, so we're doing paint protection film to it. We've already tinted the windows. After the paint protection film is done, we're going to do a ceramic coating to it. Yeah. And what's crazy about this one is the amount of gloss paint it has mm -hmm. and the amount of matte paint. It. So yep. it looks like the main body is the matte gray, and then we have all the gloss, which is the roof, hood, pretty much the whole lower skirts, too. So it's definitely an interesting look. Looks good, Last though. Last Defender came in here with like all this was plastic. For all yeah. the glosses, all that was pretty much plastic. So it was interesting getting this one in here. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of protection needs on this one. Um, and besides the PPF, what else is it getting? It's the whole trifecta. Okay, so the tin. It. Ceramic coating is coming next. Awesome. And right beside it, uh, we got this Toyota RAV4. Mm -hmm. um, and this one, what services is it getting? No, it's also getting the trifecta. Okay. So again, we already tinted the windows on this one. We're wrapping the front end. So bumper, fenders, hood, mirrors, headlights. We're doing the eight pillar roof front, and then we're mm -hmm. going to do a ceramic coating also. Okay, nice. So two trifectas in the one shop. Yep. Awesome. And here we are in our coating lab, and it's a uh, truck day in the coating lab. Yeah, there's a few. Um, so we've got this High Country Silverado. Yep. Okay, and where's this one getting? We started with the window tent. We got that done this morning. Then we are doing a ceramic coating on it now. I think they just wash it. Okay. And we're about to start polishing it and getting it coated. So this is in the beginning stages? Yep. Nice. And then back here we have, looks like another Silverado and then a Ram. And pretty much all the same thing, actually. So all tint ceramic? All tint ceramic on all these trucks today. Nice. A little common theme, I guess. Yep. And definitely, I think we do a ton of uh, trucks and SUVs because the back is already tinted privacy yep. from the factory and the two fronts, they always want them to match. Correct. So exactly. we always do a ton of two fronts with ceramic. Seems to be yep. a very popular and then package. like this one, he actually, he wanted, because the back doesn't give you any heat rejection. Yep. It's just there for looks and privacy. So we put tint all the way around this one to give it extra heat and UV rejection. Yeah. Something you want, especially if you got kids in the back, you know, yep. you have to give them that heat rejection um, all the way on the, the sides and the rear glass. Absolutely. Nice. Cool. Next, we're in our tent lab, and we have this uh, Hyundai five. Ionic 5. I think it's Ionic 5. Okay. I think um, it's just like the Kia EV6. Kia EV6. Yeah. Um, interesting look for all the electric. Yeah, they always have a certain body style. kind of gives them more of a futuristic yep. look, I guess. Um, and what services does this one get? Window tent. So they're doing that, knocking that out. We sure cut this one yesterday. Okay. So this one. Duo. It's all s slicked up, shined up, and getting the uh, heat rejection on the windows now. Yep. And behind it, we have an Audi Q8. Yeah, this Q8's a really cool color. Yeah, kind of. It's, it's not it's, Nardo. No, and it's, it's like a tannish, but more burgundy. More yeah, looks good though. Yep. And this one's getting window tint, of course. Yep. Yeah, they're knocking the windows out right now. Nice. All right, Andy, what do you got going on here? Uh, I'm getting ready to install this window right now. Um, we got to clean it really good, make sure uh, anything that the tent is actually going to touch doesn't have any dust on it because yeah. it'll all show up on here. And this window being frameless, you really just got to focus on the bottom seal and then the corner right there, the tops and the sides. Yeah, make especially it a little bit. These Audis are really tight right here, so it'll be pretty hard to get in there. Awesome. All right, and Sheldon, uh, we had last Saturday was the Ridge Runner Corvette yep. show. How'd that go? Yeah, it was actually a really good turnout. We were a little nervous because it was raining in the morning. Uh, ended up being a great show, really good turnout. Uh, me and Jim were there for a few hours, so it went good. Nice, nice, that's always good. And as far as the calendar goes, uh, you got updates on that one? Yep, so for paint protection film, have a couple of openings between now and June, but for the most part, we're almost in June. Uh, window tent. We've been knocking it out, so we get tint in here pretty quickly. Ceramic coating is about a week and a half to two weeks out. All right. Yeah, so definitely definitely get on the schedule for PPF because yeah. we're booking out. Yes. Everything else, kind of play it by ear. Yeah, but, and then, of course, we always have, you know, sometimes people have to reschedule and leave the car in time. So we might have an opening come, come up sooner. So if you need to get in quicker, let me know. We have a list to call you back on. Okay, awesome. Sounds good. Well, thanks for watching.